So it was for the, it was from my star. It's for this. Just say the English name, you weebs. All right, what's up, guys? We are here to watch my star, also known as Oshino Cole. Uh, I've been hearing a lot of good things about it. I have no idea what it's about, so let's see what it's about. How old are you? How old is this guy? How old is this guy? How old is this guy? How old is the main character? Bruh. Oh, it's a show? Okay. Oh, she's a cancer patient, huh? Pretty eyes. Damn. Yeah, they said she was 16 at the beginning, guys. Y'all y'all gotta pay attention. I tried to figure out what this nigga's name was. Let's talk about this, right? So, this is Japanese culture again. Japanese culture. They like 16-year-old girls, man. I don't, I don't know what's up with these guys. I have to respect their culture. That's what they like. I completely disagree with it. I feel like you shouldn't be attracted to a fucking little-ass girl when you're a grown-ass man. I'm just going to assume in my head that she's 18. I'm just going to assume. And also, is she pregnant by a man of her age? <laughs> oh, so, so, what the fuck? That sounded like Pokemon a little bit. Dun 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 like that. 20 weeks pregnant. Twins? Damn. That bitch about, that bitch about to have a double. Can you really stand an idol who's got a husband and kids? What the fuck am I watching? Who the fuck in Japan be green lighting this shit, bro? Who green lit this? Mm. Is he dead? No way, bro. No way that's what's about to happen, bro. No fucking way. No fucking way. That's what this is building up to this whole time. No fucking way, bro. <laughs> what am I watching, bro? What am I watching, bro? <laughs> if they have a breast, if they have a breast scene, if they have a breastfeeding scene, I'm turning this shit off. This movie or whatever movie show has beautiful animation, it has voice actors, it has music, it has sound directors, it has director, it has it has a name, it has publishing, it has backing behind it. It was, an, it was in a storyboard. They was in a storyboard phase with the writer in the writers' room. And they said, we're going to have a reincarnated baby and another reincarnated adult baby. I don't know if this baby's an adult or not, but the man, the boy is an adult. We're going to have them get breastfed by a 16 year old girl and get jealous that the other one got breastfed when they get reincarnated as babies. That's what we're going to do. Who wrote that shit down and was like, yeah. Baby Sita. <laughs> Babysitter. That's so funny how they say stuff in English sometimes, bro. Do we kill her? What the fuck? What? You were serious about it. Oh my god. They're already happy as fuck. You have no idea how happy they are. So are they gonna grow up or are they gonna be babies the whole time? A few moments later. I did grow up. Okay. I like it so far, bro. <laughs> I mean, it's not bad. It's just so weird. This is such a weird ass show, man. Three years? Wait, what? He's supposed to be three years old? You're, you're joking, right? Where's the father? Where the fuck the dad at? They ain't met their dad in three years? It probably would be a better show if it was just her. Honestly, it probably would be a better show if it was just her, I'm gonna be honest. It's the grown ass doctor that ruins it. I don't want kids. Um, Only if it's with the right person. Otherwise, no. What's going on? I 
Bro was like, I was not expecting you to say all this. Usually people would scream. Nobody would think of all this. Bitch, what? Oh, that's sweet. Don't you feel like an asshole now? Damn. We just missing a bird shot right about now. <laughs> Not crying. That was pretty sad though. That was a, that was a well made scene. I I think it was a little unrealistic how long. You know, I know what they were going for, but like. Nobody talks to a nigga that just stabbed them like that, you know. Kind of made it a little unrealistic. But other than that, it's really good. Who taking care of these niggas? Bro, just get off Twitter. You literally can't take these niggas serious. I committed suicide. <laughs> Damn. Oh, really? Oh, wow. Oh, well, that's sweet. I did not expect that. That's pretty sweet. I didn't see that coming. I'll say I didn't see that coming at all. なぜ引っ越したばかりの新居に来た。彼の男は何のスキルもない学生だった。そんな探偵みたいなことができたとは到底思えない。だけ大事にしてた。ずらっと Mm. I guess it wasn't I guess it wasn't bad. I guess it wasn't really that bad. Um I would say Um It would be better if he was like a if he was an idol, like if he was an idol worshiper too, but wasn't like a doctor or something. Or maybe he could have been a doctor. He could have been really fucking smart, like a really fucking smart ass kid, you know. But just don't be a grown ass man, bro. Like it just makes it so weird when you're a grown ass man. Like if he wasn't a grown ass man, it would have been like so much less weird, you know. Um, but yeah, I mean, um, the ending was really good. I liked, I liked it more towards the ending. It started to like actually try to tell a story, um, other than just be cute all the damn time. Um, I guess it was all right. I don't give it all right. I say it's like a, I give it like an eight, eight or nine. It's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good little, pretty good little show. I, I I see I see the appeal. I see why people like it. I see what I see it's trying to do something. It's not just it's not just it's not just using reincarnation for reincarnation's sake. It's trying to tell a story and it's not being a uh, pedophilic as I thought it would be. In you know, it is a little bit, but good. you know, looks like it's gonna be like a mystery kind of from here on out. Seeing them grow up and. The roles they play and all the characters that Inga introduced as children being adults now is also pretty interesting. And seeing what happened between him and the director, I don't see that too because he clearly didn't get raised by him. Not the worst, definitely not the worst thing I ever seen. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty, pretty decent, pretty decent. I I bet you couldn't find another show that was trying to do this this well. Yeah. What it was trying to do? Yeah, what was it trying to do? It was trying to tell a reincarnation story about. People who are obsessed with the woman that they, and then they become her ch her child. That's what it was trying to do, and it did that very, very, very well. I mean, that's just the truth. It's just the truth. 